everybody, Nova from Get Pharmacy Advice back at you again um, with another drug interaction. Yay! Today we're going to talk about SSRIs and trazodone. Mostly, that's what we're going to focus on. Now, um, trazodone is an antidepressant. SSRIs is a group of antidepressants such as, I'm just going to list a few, Prozac, Genericus Fluoxetine, Celexa, which is Genericus Citalopram, Sertraline, sorry, Zoloft, the generic is Sertraline, um, Paxil, which is Proxetine. I'm not sure if I threw that in there already. Sorry. So there's a couple of those. Those are SSRIs, um, and quite often those are taken for depression. However, the um, trazodone, which is also an antidepressant, is no normally taken for its side effect, which is sleepiness. So people can be on their Paxil and then trazodone on occasion to help them fall asleep. The problem is, is that these two um, drugs together increase the serotonin level too high, and that causes um, serotonin syndrome. Now, I'm sure you've heard of serotonin. It's one of the issues when they're low, um, it can cause depression. That's why a lot of people who are depressed are on the SSRIs. Increase the serotonin, make you feel better. It's also what we all um, experience when we eat chocolate, especially the dark chocolate. It increases our serotonin levels, gives us that, I just ate chocolate feeling. Um, and serotonin is a neurotransmitter, and it's, it's involved in a lot of things, including sleep, aggression, um, pain, the other one, appetite, anxiety. So you figure if you have too much serotonin, a lot of that is affected. So when your serotonin levels get too high, what can cause um, tremors, nausea, uh, vomiting, mania, so people can become manic, um, confusion, what's the other one, hypothermia, shivering, just feeling horrible. And it can ultimately lead to death. It's a pretty serious interaction. However, um, just a little disclaimer here is, uh, when it does happen, it usually, the symptoms usually clear up within 24 hours. It usually happens when patients start with the medications together, um, when they first put them together, or when there's an increase in one of their dosing. So you definitely want to watch out for that. You want to be out um, for a serotonin syndrome. If you start feeling a little bit, you know, if you have trouble sleeping, a little bit more manic, um, anxiety, your stomach feels horrible, shivers, tremors that those all could be signs of serotonin syndrome, which is just too high of a serotonin level in your system. Um, also, I'm just going to throw out there, if you're on one of those medications, SSRIs, um, another issue a lot of people take and they don't even think about it is their migraine medication. So if you're on a tryptan such as um, Imitrex, Sumatriptan, um, any of your migraine medications can really interact with the antidepressants as well and increase the serotonin levels to a dangerous level. So you just want to be on the lookout for that. It um, doesn't hurt to ask your pharmacist when you pick up the meds, if it's a new one, migraine, antidepressant, anything actually. Um, ask how they interact, if they interact. Um, if they don't know off the top of their head, which a lot of people don't, not a big deal, um, they can go look it up really quickly. So please stay on top of your medications. Um, ask when you have a new one if it, this will interact. And just be aware if you're on trazodone, SSRI, or you're going to start taking migraine medicine. All right, rambling on and on again and again. Uh, please come visit our site if you're not already here. Please leave us a comment, send us an email. If you have any questions or you'd like us to do a video on a specific drug or a drug interaction, holla at us, okay? Thank you very much. Bye-bye.